Good morning, guys. Um, doing a little video for you guys. Um, it is Thursday the 16th. It's 8 11. I've been fishing for an hour now, about an hour. I got here around like 7 something. So about an hour. I've been fishing using a little. I forgot what was the name of this. I bought this in Florida when I went to Florida a couple of months ago, like four months ago, that I caught my personal bass, baby. It's eight two. Eight two right now. Eight pounds, eight pounds. Anyways, um, little swim bait. Yesterday and today the water been pretty high. Can't tell, but the water's pretty high right now. It's usually not as high like this. It's pretty low. But anyways, let's um, keep going and let's see. Let's see if I could pull something out of here and pull you guys on. Um, I got to show you guys. my The way I put my videos, it's like this. So I'm sorry. It might be a little bit shaky and stuff like that. So, I, I, you know, like this is my, my phone, my, my pro, my how did I call it the other day? My phone pro, there you go. That's what it is. This is my phone pro for my, my chest mount for my phone pro. So it works. If you guys see my videos, some most of them are with this. So my phone pro works. All right, guys. <laughs> so let's, let's see. Let's see, guys. Let's see if I could put something out of here today. <clears throat> This summer here, I only I have been coming here only. I haven't really, really been um, going out fishing much. A lot of places. Um, so, I just been coming here. I, I love this spot here. I love it because it's calm, it's quiet. I love it here. But anyways, let's see. I was thinking about putting a little spinner bay on, but the wind has to pick up a little bit. If the wind picks up a little bit more, bass just got one out there. If the sun, pick, I mean the sun, if the um, wind picks up, then I'll put a spinner bay on. If not, then I can't. I mean, I still might try a spinner bay on. I don't know. We'll see. I, if you guys know and been watching my sh my videos which is not a lot of people but if you guys see my videos um you know i use a lot a lot of spinner baits right it's most of the stuff that i use spinner bait swim baits frogs obviously top water and as you can see this is top water heaven <laughs> when the bite is on here the bite is on trust me so, I might switch the color of this Kai Tech. I mean, this is not a Kai Tech. This is a Monflow Mon something. I, I don't know, guys. I, I don't know. I seriously don't know. I don't want to say a wrong name. And, you know. Macorado, another thing I wanted to tell you guys, I should have done a video before I returned it. Macorado, my old um, 7.4 Gorado. I, you know, it's a hundred and, this is $200 reel. You know, it's a $200 reel, $190, $180 plus taxes, whatever, you know. So anyways, I was fishing like three, four days ago. This is on Sunday, I think it was Sunday. Yeah, Sunday. Sunday and Monday. Anyways, <clears throat> I took my my buddy and his son to my other spot in New Britain because his kid has not his personal best was like two something, you know, it wasn't a big fish at all. So I was like, oh no, oh no, we gotta change that, buddy. We gotta change that, man. So I took him the first time, 
no, that was the third time for him there. He's been there before, but he never was able to gash nothing. So I was kind of upset about that. But I finally took him again. We went out. First cast, he threw. He killed it. It was three pounds with 40 something ounces. It was a, it was a nice fish for him. It was a nice fish for him. I was I was really happy for him. So <clears throat> the day before that, or two days before that, the day, actually the first time that I took him there, the first time I took the kid there, why did I just do that? Anyways, the first time I took the kid there, um, I cast whatever. I hooked into a fish. It was like a three pounds, like a three pounder. So I'm really it in, blah, blah, blah. All of a sudden, boom, I get slammed on my spinnerbait. I had a spinnerbait on that day. This one right here. I had this one right here. So I'm really it in, boom, he gets hit. I'm really it in. I look at my rail, it feels so, it felt weird. Like I'm like, what the hell? So I look down at my reel and I see my line literally like just in one side. Like it's not, it wasn't going like this back to back. Like, like it's supposed to be going like, so the line was stuck in like one area. So this right here, this thing right here, the thing that's supposed to go side to side, I guess it came out of the rail somehow. I don't know. And it wasn't doing his job. It was just clicking. Clack, 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 clack. <clears throat> Sorry. And yeah, I was kind of upset because I was like, damn. So I was like, damn, I, it's, you know, it's been over three months already, 90 days warranty, whatever. Well, anyways, I took it back to Cabela's and I asked him, listen, look at what's going on. This reel is supposed to be a hell of a reel. That's when it pays off when you're nice to people. You know, those people there, they know me. I'm in Cabela's almost every freaking day I go to Cabela's. You know, I go there to see if any new stuff came out or just go walk around and look at stuff. You know, you don't necessarily need to go to Cabela's to buy stuff, you know. <laughs> I go there, I go in the, in the in the aquarium, I go upstairs, you know, I just go to the restaurant, eat a little burger, you know, have lunch or something like that, you know, I just take my son there a lot, that's like my son getaway spot, mine and my son heaven spot, we call it, <laughs> we be, I'll be playing with my son and shit, you know, it's fun, it's fun, you know. And those people there, they know me. They know my son. I could let my son go walk around and I know my son will be safe because everybody there knows my son. Sometimes I get a little sketched out because there's some fucked up people out in this day on world. But anyways, so I go and I explain to them and the guy was like, listen, bro, you don't got to explain to me. I see what's going on. I see what happened to it. He was like, you want to take your line back? And I'm like, you know what? Yeah, I don't have money right now to buy a new line. So, yeah, let me bring it for they could respool my new reel with it. He was like, no problem. These people didn't give me no problem. No problem at all. So, if you're looking for a good customer service place, go to Cabela's in East Hartford. Those people are just huh, phenomenal, man. They're, they're great. The guy is in... There's three guys that I talk a lot in in fishing department. One of them is Matt, and the other two guys, wow, wow, I forgot their names. But they're, they're nice guys, man. Nice people, nice people there. Nice people there. Every single one of them. So, anyways, oh, the wind did pick up a little bit. Look, as soon as I put that spinner bait, the wind picked up a little bit. That's good. So. That little thump. So, anyways, they you know they respilled it for me. Did what they had to do. Let me go up and come down. That way the sun is not on my phone and it overheats it. I don't want my phone to get overheated. So the um 
they gave it back to me they I put it on the you know they put the line gave it back no problem no problem nada de problema at all no Paul for real this rail is phenomenal I never had I never had a problem with it until three days uh, like four or five days ago and you know as long as that's one thing man when you buy something this like this type of expensive like you know over a hundred dollars make sure you unless you're a rich guy that you like spending money but I'm not a rich guy that like to spend I like to spend money but I'm not a rich guy <laughs> I mean who doesn't like to spend money so Garado 200 HG Shimano Microsoft uh, model Microsoft micro <laughs> micro model <laughs> Yeah, that's the new model coming out, by the way. Microsoft model real. <laughs> you could browse the web and everything. And in that, in that bitch. Check your Facebook while you're fishing and everything. You know? Top of the line. Next year, coming out. Keep your eye out. <laughs> no, but hold just to the side. Um, I had a couple of reels before. I only been fishing about for two years bass fishing so I you know haven't been through a lot of reels my first reel was a loose um, the white one I forgot what, what what was the model of that reel but it was the loose um, it was like a hundred and sixty dollar reel it was a 7.4 or 7.5 gear, um, gear re shield on it and it was pretty good it was a good it was a good reel I'm not gonna lie it was a really good reel but but <laughs> if you wanted to cast out far, forget it. Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, uh, oh, oh, I just got a hit. But yeah, my first reel was a lose, and it, it didn't. It, it was a good reel, but it didn't go out far at all. So. I did that for a while and then I bought a. What was my second one? A Shimano. Oh, that was my buddy Rob asking me if I caught anything. Nope, not yet, bro. Um, so. Ah, oh, fuck. The second one. The, second reel that I had was a Shimano because after the lose everything I had since then it was it's been Shimano 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 I just love Shimano there's another reel that came out I forgot what's the name of it I mean it, uh, yeah it's another reel but I forgot the name of it and then there's another um reel from Shimano that is the DC um DC Shimano oh my god 200 uh DC that fucking thing, that freaking thing is huh, awesome. It's like the cheaper version of the one that has the X chip on it. It's like $500. It's just like that one, but $200 cheaper. It's like $350, $300 something. So, I don't know, guys. I. I don't know if that spinner base is going to be here today. Like I said, this lake is funny. I'm about to start flipping. That's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm about to start flipping in this bitch. Yep. Water's not too dirty. Yesterday I was going to start flipping, but the water was murky as hell because it's been raining on up. Up in the east, or uh, yeah, up high, it's been fucking raining like a motherfucker. You guys see where I'm throwing my, my spinner bay, right? I hope you guys see all this. And it goes through it fairly well. Look at that. Nothing on it. Nothing. Yes, you have to horse it through. But 
it goes pretty well on heavy cover. A lot of people don't use spinner baits because, oh, there's a lot of cover. Man, fuck you. Stop being lazy. Run that bitch through there and watch what you're going to get out of there. Might not get a fish, you know, as much as you want to, but when you do, <laughs> be ready for it. Fish just popped up there. Could have been a carp, I don't know. Yep, the carp. Look at him. Look at that shit. Woof. <laughs> I hope you guys seen that. I uh, hope you guys seen it. That was humongous. That carp was huge. Anyways, guys, I don't want to make this video too long because then it's going to take forever to upload. So I'm just going to cut it here. I'm sorry that, you know, I wasn't able to put a fish on the video, but that's what I, I, I like doing it like this because that way you guys know, like, it's real. You know, this is how it is. Some days you go out. Some days you go out and you kill it, and some days you go out and you get scammed. Uh, you get scammed. <laughs> you get skunk. Um, I know my language is my 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 English is not that good. I'm Puerto Rican, freaking spicks. <laughs> I'm joking, guys. I'm joking. Um, but thank you for if you do watch the video. Thank you for watching. I'll try to make another video every morning because I fish during the day, during the morning. So I'll try to make a video every day from now on. Please, thumbs up if you like it. If you don't, you don't, you know? If you like, if you will share it, I will appreciate that. And if you don't, you don't. So have a nice day, guys. God bless. Stay safe out there. And try to grab a rod every other day and go out and get it wet. Feel me? So, keep fishing, guys. Never stop. I took that from John B. I love that saying. I love the way he says it. Not the way he says it, but I love that saying. You know, that just that saying. Keep fishing, never stop. I like that. Anyways, guys, I think I want to get a tattoo of that saying, keep fishing, never stop. Anyways, alright guys, God bless, love you.